Sick about you since you were missing a few weeks ago. What are you doing here? Where are we? We're in cell block 22, like located here off the ISD room. Cell block? Yes. Evidently, certain students in the building have been running a secret prison, and they're incarcerating people for doing things they don't like. It's the nerds. They're doing this? What did you do to get thrown in here? I gave one of them too much homework. Next thing you know, I'm in here. Well, we got to get out of here. We got to come up with some plan. I'm just sweet talking the guard. He's the one to help us. He's willing to deliver the letter to the principal, but I haven't had any pen or paper. What do you have with you? Well, I've got this. Let's get right in. To whom it may concern, I am writing to inform you that I and one of your esteemed colleagues have been captured and are being held here in the school. Your assistance... Wait, what are you writing? Mr. Cronkake will never believe that. You're not using clear or strong voice. You have to let your personality and your emotions show in the letter. I'm writing the principal of the school. I need to impress him so we take the letter seriously. No, you need to speak out with voice. Speak directly to him and let him know that you feel strong about our situation and you want him to feel strong enough that he'll come help us. Trust me, this letter will get his attention. These kids, they're always trying to pull something. It's been a week since we sent the letter. Why hasn't the principal responded? I tried to tell you, you need to use better voice. It wasn't the right style. You need to reveal yourself behind your words and really speak to him in the letter. Well, let me try again. Yeah. Dear Mr. Crumb Cake Help. Not again. <gasps> Set up a perimeter. 
perimeter, surround the area, round up the nerds. Are you two all right? It was a good thing you got me that second letter. I thought the first letter was a joke. I knew it. I told you to use more voice. We found the ringleader. Take him away. You haven't heard the last of me. I'll get you both. Somehow I believe him. That's because he's using a strong voice. Okay, let's go.